All right, guys. For those of you who've been watching my channel for a while, you know that I have reported a lot on VAST. So now we get an opportunity to have a look at a space station module. I believe this is Haven 2 that we're going to be looking at. Haven 1, actually. Good. I've got folks correcting me on this today. So let's go check it out. The aesthetics here are really amazing. It's just beautiful in here. It really stands out tremendously compared to the utilitarian appearance of the International Space Station. All the paneling, just beautiful. But really, it's an amazing, amazing, oh, have a look. <laughs> the bio capsule, as it is called. But to give you an idea, we're looking at 3D printing of a variety of different space age materials, things that can only be manufactured in zero gravity or microgravity. And then in addition to that, you're also looking at 3D printing of things like human organs up here and other biological materials. And then, of course, space tourism also. So right now we have the airlock, obviously, at least that's what it appears to be. And uh, yeah, it, again, just to get an idea of, of what we're seeing here, this is a dramatic change compared to the sorts of space station modules that we've seen in the past. Clearly, VAST is trying to make a statement here, offering a much, much different look aesthetically compared to the types of modules that uh, we used to see in space before. A, dramatic difference. Let's have a look back in here one more time. So once again, folks, the common area in here. Ah, I missed that. So we get a spectacular view of the Earth, obviously, through that port. Just a dramatic, dramatic uh, appearance for a space station module. Can't wait to see what VAST has next. Thank you so much for your time.